no one will ever be able to call themselves the first head coach of the Seattle Kraken franchise. That title belongs to Dave Haxtell. Coach, take me back to your reaction. This has been a crazy week when Ron Francis let you know you got the job. What did you feel? How did you celebrate? Oh, we were we were excited. Both I was with my family at the time, so obviously uh, pretty happy, uh, pretty happy family. Great day, and uh, was uh, was a great phone call to get. Uh, and then, of course, the, the next thought was to uh, really, uh, really quick, uh, getting a few bags packed and uh, heading out to Seattle. Yeah, quite a whirlwind. Well, you called this a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to build the identity of the Seattle Kraken from the ground up. Why do you feel like the, you're the right choice for this job? Well, it's you know, it's something as I've gotten to to know Ron over time, uh, and uh, you know, as I've been able to you know have a great opportunity to get to know uh, some of uh, you know some of the other management uh, people that are in place, the ownership group, uh, Todd Lewicki, uh, just an amazing group of people. And for me to have the opportunity to, uh, to come in and be part of that, uh, I'll take an awful lot of pride in. Uh, you know, I've, I've, I've watched pretty closely uh, over time as things have been developing uh, with the organization there in Seattle. Um, you know, I've, uh, I've got a pretty strong thought press of process and, and a vision of where I'd like to uh, see our team go. Uh, and along with everybody else that's already in place, uh, I'm going to work really hard to make sure that happens. Well, the expansion draft is July 21st, where you get to choose a player from each NHL team, but you don't find out which players you can choose from until July 17th. How do you prepare for that quick turnaround? Well, that's, you know, Ron and his staff are way ahead of uh, everything on that. They've put in a ton of time, and uh, they'll be very, very well prepared uh, for, uh, for that uh, part of uh, of the process here, great opportunity for us to build a team. It's going to be an exciting time, uh, you know, extremely exciting time for uh, for all of us and for the city of Seattle uh, to start putting some of the names and the faces into place uh, for that inaugural team. Yeah, the city cannot wait for that. Do you and Ron Francis have a favorite style of play you want to see on the ice, or are you waiting until after you have a full roster for that? Well, I, you know, I, you know, some of that goes into the preparation going in, and I, you know, I think a lot of the words that you'll see that are, you know, that are common, uh, you know, for sure between Ron and his staff and myself is, you know, intelligent players, um, you know, players that can play the game fast. So speed is a real critical element, uh, and then, I mean, the game of hockey, the you know, the word competitiveness is going to be a huge part of our uh, of our hockey team. And developing young players is essential as you're building this team. You coached more than 30 players into the NHL when you were at the University of North Dakota. What's the most important part of that process for you? Every player is different. Um, everybody has to take it at you know at the, the pace that's right for them. Um, and you know I had, I had a great opportunity to work with so many good people, great players, but you know even better people. Uh, so the you know the consistency and the work ethic that, uh, that a player can bring to the table. Uh, through the ups and downs of developing into an NHL player uh, really is key. So, you know, it, it, our jobs as, as coaches is, is to help those players be at their best, uh, help them overcome, uh, you know, challenges along the way uh, and, and, you know, be as great as they can be. And you've had a few days to soak it in in Seattle when you were here, meet people. Uh, are you excited to play, call this place home? I can't, uh, can't wait. What a, what a tremendous setting. The energy around town. Um, the excitement uh, around the Seattle Kraken and the fan base uh, was was evident. It was awesome. Uh, the, my you know my couple days in town there were simply awesome. And what excites you when you see a player? I mean, what what really stands out when you first see a player? Everybody's different. Every player brings something. Um, you know, so the energy they bring to the table on a daily basis. Somebody that loves the game. Somebody that's a great teammate. Um, you know, those are all key factors and you can see that and you can feel that from a player when he walks in a room, when he uh, walks in the dressing room and he gets on the ice. Um, and then from there, every player brings something different, but everybody brings that ash, uh, that, that passion, that excitement uh, and the energy to the rink. And those are, you know, those are guys that we want to have in our dressing room. And coach, last question from me. What do you picture when you think of a Kraken? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, you know, the myth, the mythical beast, the mythical animal, um, you know what, it's, uh, it's phenomenal. And um, the job uh, that has been done in putting the Kraken uh, name in place and uh, just the merchandise, uh, it's awesome. My, my kids are so excited about it. Everybody, uh, you know, everybody around the country uh, is, is very soon going to want some of the, uh, some of the gear 
and be part of uh, the, the, you know, the whole crack and uh, aura. The team is mythical now, but it will be real so soon. Coach, we cannot wait to see this team get on the ice. Best of luck this season. Thank you so much.